sorry, sniffing. Um, I just got in from school. Uh, it's freezing outside. Um, I can't feel my lips. I cannot feel my hands because I've been um, texting Caitlin on the way back from school, and I have to have my hands out, and ah, oh, it hurts. I look like a mess. So yeah, I think Caitlin, you said something about my hair. Yeah, I look at it now. It's not like cool at all. It's just awful. Right. Okay. I just as you come in and turn the laptop straight on. Oh, I look a mess. Um. Yeah, sorry, I haven't made one of these in a long time. Um, I don't know if there's reason behind that. Well, mm, there was a whole issues with everything going on. Um, with like, oh, ugh, I look like a mess. Um, yeah, and with the things and the, the father issues and the mother issues and the depression issues and the random panic attack issues, uh, so between all that I didn't really have a lot of strength to make a video um, but I am now and I'm hoping you'll forgive me for that and I cannot feel my hands for the life of me goodness now I'm inside the house I'm getting really hot again <sighs> oh it's not stiffing I think I'm going to go and make me some lunch because it's what time is it 1.49 in the afternoon and I just got back from school uh, I had a free afternoon uh, I don't finish it this time every day. Although that would be great if I did, but I don't. Um, I had a really crappy and pointless day. I had a panic attack when I was in the library, um, which was just not fun at all, um, obviously. And um, that was really stressing me out. And so I just, the library, people were being really noisy and stuff um, because the librarian was out for a bit. And so people would just start talking and I was getting really freaked out, and really stressed out. Um, so I left the school for about an hour and luckily my school is, I, yeah, I've sort of shown you, uh, it's like in a park. Um, so I just went and sat out there for an hour and then came back in. It was um, a free lesson so I could just leave if I wanted to. Yeah, so that was that and yeah, now I'm hungry and I've got to make food. I'm going to go make myself food and then I'll come back. Okay. I'm back and I have tea and I have bagels and cream cheese. That's all good. Oh, tea's a bit hot right now. Oh, uh, I'm sure you'll want to see that. Uh, okay, nothing. A bit let down. Uh, oh, it's wonky. That way. That way. No. Um, let me just straighten this. It's not really straightening up. Sorry, it's on my bed right now. I've got a foot on bed, so it's like on the floor. Um, yeah, nothing much to report apart from the whole job thing. Yeah, that was weird and unexpected <laughs> seeing as I interviewed on Saturday morning and my first shift. I got the job and my first shift for Sunday morning. <sighs> Mental. Um, yeah, so that's gonna be absolutely grueling especially when panto starts because then I'll have panto on Friday nights and Saturday nights well I'll have it every day in the week but um, when I have it on Friday and Saturday nights the next day I'll have to get up at 5 a.m. and travel to the golf course um, which is gonna be very tiring but luckily that period will only last for about three weeks so yeah look I wrote on my hand you can't read that motherfuckers video because I definitely I didn't know what I was going to do on but I definitely wanted to do one because I feel I haven't talked to quite a few of you guys in a while and that's because I haven't really been on Skype that much um because of issues um and so and time zones have just been messing up and I haven't been on at the same time as people uh which has been annoying <laughs> can't get comfortable um yeah so that's been so you americans are lucky because i'm sure you're just rolling around in like an abundance of bagels and we have to buy we've got these like new york bagels um and uh yeah they're really expensive and so we get them really rarely and stuff so um you lucky bastards on the postcard front i did i did buy you those postcards let me get them They're still in the uh, bag I got them in. 
I've got five postcards here. They're really like cheesy, generic sort of London postcards. Um, but I was thinking as soon as Christmas is coming up, um, I wouldn't send the postcards just yet. I'd send, um, well, I could send the postcards inside a card, but um, I thought that would be sort of really pointless and I could just sort of do another lot of um, postcards sort of early next year or something like that. So I thought we'd do that instead. So I'm going to go out and get like you guys um, Christmas cards or <laughs> I would make them, but I'm really, really crap at making Christmas cards. So that's probably not the best idea for me to do that. School's going okay. Um, boring as usual with tests, got coursework, um, physics coursework coming up next week which will be a nightmare <laughs> because it's on, well it's on thermal physics on um, specific heat capacity which I absolutely hate and I can't do that topic and then the other bit of coursework is on simple harmonic motion which I like and I enjoy doing but I just, I get it wrong all the time, I'm just completely sort of failing physics this year <laughs> which is not great. Oh yeah, uh, I sent off my university application. I did I mention that in the last? No, I couldn't have mentioned it because I only did it last week. Yes, I sent off my university applications. Um, and so now they're currently, they go through your form tutor, then they go through your head of year, or the head of sixth form. Um, sixth form is like the last two years of high school. Um, and then it'll go to the head teacher. The head teacher signs it off, and then it'll go up to UCAS. And my form tutor has only just signed it off, so now it's it's still going to take a while so it'll be probably end of this week maybe that it'll get actually sent off to UCAS which is the um, governing body of universities and college applications and stuff so uh, it'll be sent off then and then it will go to the universities and then they can look at my application they can look at my grades they can look at my personal statement and then decide if they want me for university or not which is exciting but bloody scary at the same time because I'm just absolutely pet there is one university that I really really want to go to which is the University of Winchester and I've said this so many times I loved it and the course is just brilliant and the location is stunning it's just in sort of picture traditional English countryside it's, it's in that and I I would die to go there which would be really pointless because I'd be dead but I'd die and for some reason oh, this is not going to end well Day. Okay. For some reason, uh, my computer doesn't show me how long it's been recording for. It just says recording in progress, which is not helpful. Um, <laughs> so I don't know how long this is going to be. Probably end up cutting loads down. I'll probably end up cutting this down, actually. So yeah, the embrace episode happened. I'm actually, gosh, that <laughs> shows how long it's been since I've um, made a video. The embrace, that was sweet, wasn't it? Not long enough. It was, uh, it was emotional enough, but it just sort of it cut off and that really annoyed me. I was like, is that it? Is that it? Um, and it was, but it was sweet nonetheless. And yeah, the amount of flailing afterwards. <laughs> oh, this fandom's crazy. Hey, look, Jenna, I can do cool things as well. Look, I have a crown. It's a really bad crown because it's like framing my face. Ah, ah, it's gone. There you go. See, I've got a crown too. Yay, look, I have an arrow through my eyes. Hey. I'm sorry, but this is beats everything. That's just, I think it suits me. I think it suits me, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, oh, I don't know what I'm meant to be. Oh, that's crappy. I don't know what this is meant. Oh, check that out. That's trippy. That's extremely trippy. I, I'm like desaturated and saturated, desaturated, saturated. Desaturated. Saturated. This looks stupid. This is funky. I like this. Apart from my eyes look really black and they're not black. And like, it's like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> uh. I feel like Snape. 